Hello boys and girls. I hope that you are all well and that you are having a lovely and blessed weekend. Before we start with our lesson today, I would like us to pray together please. Let's close our eyes and pray. Dear God, bless us in our Sunday school and our lesson today. Help us grow in love and kindness more like Jesus every day. In Jesus name. Amen. Today's reading is taken from John 1 verses 1 to 14. The word became flesh. In the beginning was the word, and the word was with God, and the word was God. He was with God in the beginning. Through him all things were made. Without him nothing was made that has been made. In him was life, and that life was the light of all mankind. The light shines in the darkness and the darkness has not overcome it. There was a man sent from God whose name was John. He came as a witness to testify concerning that light, so that through him all might believe. He himself was not the light. He came only as a witness to the light. The true light that gives the light to everyone was coming into the world. He was in the world, and though the world was made through him, the world did not recognize him. He came to that which was his own, but his own did not receive him. Yet to all who did receive him, to those who believed in his name, he gave the right to become children of God, children born not of natural descent nor of human decision or a husband's will, but born of God. The word became flesh and made his dwelling among us. We have seen his glory the glory of the one and the only Son, who came from the Father, full of grace and truth. This is the word of the Lord. John, one of Jesus' disciples, wrote to tell people about who Jesus is. John wrote, that the word Jesus existed in the beginning before the world even began. The word has always existed with God and the word has always existed as God. He was with God in the beginning. When God spoke at creation, all things were created through his word. Not one thing was created apart from him. The word brought life into the world and light for all people. The light shines in the darkness and the darkness could not hide it. God sent a man named John the Baptist to be a witness to the light. John was not the light, but he came to tell people about the light so they might believe. The true light was coming into the world to give light to everyone. When Jesus came into the world, people did not recognize him. His own people did not accept him, but this is good news. To everyone who did accept him, he gave them the right to be a part of God's family, to be children of God. The word became a human and lived among us. People saw his glory, the glory of the one and only Son of God. He was full of grace and truth. John the Baptist told people that even though Jesus came into the world after him, Jesus is greater because he existed before John. People received blessings from Jesus, grace upon grace. Long ago, God gave people the law through Moses, but now he has given us grace and truth through Jesus Christ. No one has ever seen God, but Jesus, God's one and only son, has shown us what God is like. The birth of Jesus was good news. Jesus was no ordinary baby. He was God's son, sent to earth from heaven. Jesus came into the world as a human to bring us life. He brought light into darkness and showed us what God is like. It's the light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine It's the light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine It's the light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine 
Let us pray. Dear Jesus, show us how to spend this day sharing your love in every way. Help us to be kind to everyone, to play and laugh and have lots of fun, shining your light and giving your grace, sharing your joy with a smile on our face. In Jesus' name, Amen. Thank you so much for listening, boys and girls. May your day overflow with God's blessings. Have a lovely and blessed Sunday.